Oh, they got the Sriracha here for $3? They got the Sriracha here for $3? It's crazy. Bruh. <laughs> Hold on, bro. You think this is real? About to show you guys. If you guys shop at Aldi or you have an Aldi next to you, we're gonna show you some things that you can get on a low carb, animal based diet. Get out of the street, she's driving crazy. Yeah, they have a lot of high protein snacks, lower carbs. We're gonna show you right now what they got. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. If you guys have been here before, welcome back. Obviously they have a bunch of produce here. If you guys are looking for produce, and they have a bunch of like snacks here and nuts, stuff like that. These are actually not bad. These seaweed joints, I'll wrap some protein in them. Not a bad price. But they also have a bunch of nuts here, which I don't eat really any of this stuff, almonds or any of this stuff, I don't really eat it. What's this? For salads. Let me see. This is like the chicken, look. 11 grams of carbs, we're not doing that. But they do have bacon bits here. Bacon bits is good for when I eat some of my salads. But um, on this other side, it's just a bunch of produce over there. It's obviously, a, it looks fresh, so, you know, if you guys like produce, you can grab some stuff. Me, personally, I would eat too much of that stuff, so I'm not a fan like that but they do have a lot of lower carb breads. Look, protein wraps right here, as you can see. 12 grams. 12 grams of protein. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This one has a little bit more carbs, but like I said, if you're on a lower carb or just a higher protein diet, you can go ahead and grab some of these. They have a different one. That one has a flavor to it. Look, they got keto wraps. Keto friendly. This one's lower in calories, lower in protein though. But it has 13 grams of fiber, so it knocks off those carbs. This one's seven grams of carbs. What happened? 12 grams of protein. It's not bad. You get a keto bread. And the prices are not that bad compared to a lot of other places. So, but I, I don't know, for some reason, you know, Aldi has a lot of uh, keto friendly and higher protein type of foods in here. So uh, definitely interested in that. And if you're on a higher protein diet, definitely check up uh, on Aldi's. They have some low calorie bread right here too, 45 calories per slice. It's well, not bad. No, they have a lot. They have no, like they a bunch lot. of keto stuff. A bunch of stuff. But, I mean, we don't really need any of that, to be honest. But as yeah. you can see here, but PB2. Okay. Definitely grab you some PB2. It's not a bad Six price either. 7.99, 6 grams of protein. How much carbs? 5 grams of carbs per serving. 4. 4 grams of carbs. You oh, take out the fiber. Of fiber. It's not bad. That's still not bad. That's very good. You can put that in protein shakes, you can put that in whatever, some milk, whatever you want. See, put it in your cereal, put that shit in whatever you want. What, the regular peanut butter? This is like what we would eat if you wanted to put a scoop of this in. That's like it. Yeah, but That's that has good. 190 calories. For the same serving size, and this one has 60. Yeah. With almost the same amount of protein. We're not doing that. So if you guys can see here, on this side right here, obviously we got beef jerky. That's not a bad price right there at all. Spicy garlic. Spicy garlic, yeah, 379, that's not bad at all. Sure. They have other flavors too, Aloha teriyaki, barbecue, Korean barbecue. That's For probably sure. fire. This one and the teriyaki or spicy wow. garlic? Wow. Can I try all three? It doesn't matter. Let's do all three, let's do we it. We got sticks on it. Meat sticks, zero sugar, as you can see here. Those have uh, ca uh, carbs, though. I know. So Pretty sure. They're not high carbs, though. Okay. Very low low carbs. These right here is zero carbs. Ooh, Korean barbecue is the highest, as far as... Nine grams of protein, zero carbs. 
and they have a, just a bunch of protein. So this will all fall under either carnivore or a higher protein type of diet. As you can see here, more, more beef jerky. 10 grams of protein, nine grams of carbs per serving. We got chomps. These are everywhere though, right? Chomps. Yeah, I wonder how the price is compared to. 239. It's not a bad price. We got beef sausages. One gram of carbs. If you guys are into sausage. <laughs> it's a bunch of nonsense right here. A bunch of chips. We're not feeling. We're not feeling this. I'm pretty sure they got some type of protein chips here though. They obviously got some snacks, some cookies right here. I just feel like the pricing here all these fairly cheap over here. Like, look at this. A lot of you guys, like, these are trash to me. Like, I don't eat these at all anymore. But I know a lot of you guys like them. $6.98 for a box. It's not bad at all. You got your regular cheeses, ribs. They got all kind of little cookies and crackers right here. And the prices are fairly cheap. Like, for cheese that's right here. For this box, $2.45. You can see that down there. It's not bad at all. Laughing. These are a very good snack for you. No, we could try them. These are a very good snack for you. Only a dollar. One gram of carb. Seven grams of protein. This is a good find right here. For a dollar. There's no excuses. I'm not saying it's the best source. But to curve your chips and all that stuff you don't want to eat. This is not bad. The kombucha looks pretty cheap here. Kombucha looks fairly cheap here. We're gonna grab one of these actually for our gut health. Let's go here, hold this. We should have just got a basket. Which one, this one? Yeah, that's a good flavor. That's Usually those are like five bucks everywhere else, right? Yeah. It's not a bad price, $2.99 at all. So we got some protein shakes here, stuff like that. I don't eat any of this or drink any of that. Is this the one you were saying, the pop, poly pop or whatever? There's Oli pop and there's poppy. But this one has it probiotics? Has, yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's outside of the Water, their flavors, marshmallow root, strawberry, casa, apple juice concentrate, stevia, Himalayan salt, strawberry flavor. either 189 for coconut water uh, 16, grams of 16 grams of protein but that probably has hella carbs in it so 17 grams of carbs that's protein. actually not that bad to have a quick low protein shake something like for us i mean well i guess it's not that bad you got a little salads gatorades got some sparkling water down there little snacks and stuff like that i'm just not into that Let's see what we got over here. Some keto matcha. Look, one gram of net carbs, three grams of net carbs. Not bad, I don't know what this is. Are these protein bars or what are these? Little packets? It's not bad for people who just need something quick. One gram of protein, 90 calories. I heard uh, green tea has a lot of benefits for you. And then you got the keto coffee right here, which is not bad, caramel macchiato. I haven't tried it, but hey. For the price, go ahead and get you some of these 60 calories. Got a lot of carbs in it, but it has net net carbs. Oh, because it has okay, well net carbs in there, that's not bad at all. And then obviously we've got some cheese right here. This would can be considered some carnivore or higher protein. It's like salami rolled up cheese or whatever. Hmm. 12 grams of protein. Have you? Yeah. Yeah. We got six shakes right here, protein shakes. Not bad at all. Seven dollars. As you can see here, I don't want to hear any excuses. Meal replacement shakes right here. Protein puffs. Ten grams of protein. It's got a lot of carbs in it. Twenty-four grams of carbs. But if you're training and you just got done training, that wouldn't be a bad source right there. Or before training. Another one right here. 
protein bars, got fiber in it. The prices, man, it's not bad at all. So Aldi's obviously a better spot when it comes to value for the price. You find anything over here? Bunch of keto bars. Hmm? Keto, keto support, keto, keto. Everything is keto here. Everything is, they really, really uh, have a lot of options. Even protein powder right here. Boom, 18 bucks. You can literally get whatever you want here. And a lot of it has protein. I have way too many carbs. Protein bars down there. Maybe. Oh, that's disgusting. But yeah, I heard it's like good for you. That looks like a... RX. Yeah. Those protein puffs, what are they talking about? 42 grams of protein. For the whole bag? <laughs> no. Oh yeah, for the whole bag per container. 42 grams of protein, four grams of carbs. Not bad at all. We'll try it out. Flavor, the other one. That, that flavor's probably better. Here, hold this. Should I go get a cart? Uh, let's yeah, let's go get a cart. That's a good coffee, right? Yeah, That's pretty cheap, right? Yeah. See, the prices here are fairly cheap. Tea. Green tea. It's not bad. See this sugary shit? Stay away from this shit right here. All this shit right here? Stay away from all of this shit right here. Protein pancakes? Protein pancake mix, see? $3.99, you can't go wrong. Obviously there's gonna be some carbs in this. We expect that, they're pancakes. How many grams per serving? 14 grams per serving. Look, everything here, protein, protein. They highly emphasize protein. So whoever is their inventory, whatever, He's doing something right. Got some syrup. The whole, all this grainy stuff we don't really eat anymore. But protein, granola protein, two dollars. You could definitely stack up here if you're a protein head, which you should be. You should stack up here. We have any electrolyte drinks here and stuff like that. I'm not a fan. Prime. We don't drink Prime. I don't see Prime in here. Where? Where? There's no Prime here. Where? Get this bullshit out of here. I'm pretty sure they got some type of protein cereal. Ah, maybe not. But you see just a bunch of regular snacks and stuff. got any other sauces that are special i'm pretty sure they got some type of like protein sauce here or something oh they got the sriracha here for three dollars they got the sriracha here for three dollars is crazy Bruh. hold on bro you think this is real it has a green cap on it yeah it looks more red than the other one Bro, I ain't gonna lie. They got the Sriracha here for $3.79. I'll be buying this shit for like $8. That's pretty good. Should we grab two? Should we get a cart? Yeah. Hopefully. You can grab deli meat. That's not a bad price at all. Look at this. Some of these deli meats. Like you can find these at Target and stuff. That pizza does look fire. And it's 50% off of seven ninety nine, three bucks for that. Ultimate meat. Mm -hmm. Dang, these look, are good chicken. Chicken. Look. Chicken. Yeah, chicken. Flat bread. chicken. Stuff. Six bucks for this? Is that Chicken it? egg rolls. 
get you guys fixed on three bucks. That's not bad. I get one of these at Panda for fucking three bucks. It's not bad at all. What is that? Shredded chicken? Six bucks for this whole thing of shredded chicken. It's not bad. Obviously. 23 grams of protein times five. So 125 grams of protein. Only 140 per serving. See, you could eat something like this all day. You'd be straight shredded. See, we're missing anything. We'll go down that aisle after. And obviously, they got some stuff here. Ground lamb is crazy. That's probably fire. Ground lamb for 585 is not bad. Got some chicken. Sorry about that. What's this? This chicken? Seasoned chicken right here. Diced chicken, $2.99. Pastor chicken, $2.29 for this whole thing. It's crazy. Chicken legs or chicken thighs? It's not bad. Chicken thighs for $3.29. That's not bad at all. Let's see? So this is definitely a place you guys can shop, man. We can make our own Korean barbecue. Shredded steak. How much is that? $5.49. Sausage for breakfast. Ooh, $2. Two dollars. Not bad. Original and Damn, it's not bad at all either. It's just some big boys. Obviously, this is the red meat, the steak. Yeah. Those are like very red. This is not bad right here for some masala. Look, all this seventy-three twenty-seven, especially if you're on carnivore. Five pounds for fifty. You guys could definitely go ahead. pounds of round steak for 10 bucks. You guys grab some of that. Huh? It's not bad at all. Here's some pretty good prices. I don't know what that is. Don't even touch that. This shit look nasty as hell. I kind of want to touch it. Touch it looks like a balloon. Yeah. Shit look like a fucking straight something in there marinating. Technically, you want to eat sockeye salmon. Technically, you want to eat sockeye seafood. Sockeye is supposed to be the best for you. Nah, that was only. Uh, I don't know why they put it like that. But, uh, so, yeah, man, this is going to be the meat section here. Good prices, not bad at all. Those are usually about $2 in the store. This is the basic price right there. I guess it's where you're going to find like your sausages and your pork sausages and chicken sausage. And Breakfast sausage and bacon. That's actually a good price for bacon yeah, compared to the bucks. store right now. Wow, that's actually. You see that? Four, five bucks. That would be fourteen bucks where we shop. How's the butter? Sweet cream. Mm -hmm. So the butters, you already know. I went over on my last video. This right here looks like it's probably going to be the best pure Irish butter. Ingredients, very low ingredients, as you guys know, I talked about in the other video, which may be something like this. Let's see the ingredients on here. Oh, it's not bad at all either. It's actually not bad for the butters. Got some water. Obviously, we buy our waters from Trader Joe's. Oh, wow, they got this. West Spring water, where? Where? So yeah, stay away from this purified stuff get you some spring water right here three bucks for the case not bad don't like in a little lit okay go ahead and get you some of that wine man some of the wine prices are kind of decent apothic this is kind of what we drink that's usually about 10 bucks everywhere you go and i don't see anything else that looks eye appealing huh the yogurts Yeah, if you guys are yogurt people, they definitely have some protein options here with the yogurt. 14 grams. 14 grams of protein. 63 cents. It's not bad. You guys go ahead and, oh, and they got the, the Greek yogurt. That's kind of better for you, right? Oh, so this is Greek yogurt too. So yeah, 63 cents. Go ahead and stock up. That's low fat. That's not bad at all. We don't really drink orange juice or any type of juice like that. 
That shit just has way too much, way too much. Let me, a lot of you guys like this stuff here, right? Let me show you something. I showed you guys a comparison to my last video. This shit's in Spanish. Paco Socarretos. 14 grams. I don't know what the fuck I just said. But honestly, you know what? I feel like this store, everything is like a lot less sugary calories. I think this store in general might be a healthier store. Yes. Seriously, because I mean, overall, like for the option that you have, for the, it's better than the actual yeah. store. But like even this though, creamer, you gotta look at the ingredients because this is zero sugar, so it sounds good. But look, water. The second yeah. ingredient is soybean oil. Yeah, we don't want any type of oil, soybean oils, none of that shit. That's not good. Calories. See, 26 carbs, 22 grams of sugars. We don't want this. What? Even the oat one, like, it's more calories. It's cane sugar, sunflower oil, palm oil. Yeah, we don't want that. No good. No good. Get you some green tea. No good. No good. No good. No good. All of our eggs and milk, we kind of get at Trader Joe's. But if you guys are shopping here, you already know. Go ahead and grab it. Grab what you need to. But look, if you guys like beer, let me show you guys something. Let me show you something. Is there somewhere I could hold this? Look, if you guys like beer, get you 90 calories, get you a Corona Premier. They're the same price. $15, $15. Two grams of carbs. Cavesa. Cerveza. Cerveza. Right? <laughs> but I feel like those are hard to find. I haven't really seen those. And these are usually about 24 bucks for a 12 pack. Remember? Mm -hmm. And then you got your Corona Extra. Way worse for you. Chicken strips? Got you some chicken strips. That's not a bad price either. Chicken strips for $6.75. Got you some beef, beef patties, like Angus stuff. Let me open it up so you can get a better look. Grilled chicken strips. Grilled chicken strips. Duck. If you guys are feeling that, let me know. We got some salmon in here. Got some tilapia flounder. The fuck is flounder? I've never heard of that. That's flounder dory. fish? Huh? I'm pretty sure that's dory. Really? Cod? Damn, two pounds of cod. That's not a bad price. You can get mussels for $3. And then they got obviously a bunch of just like frozen foods. They got some pizzas and stuff like that. We got some chicken egg rolls. Look, this right here, chicken taquitos. 11 grams of protein. As you can see on all of their packaging, they try to put the protein part on there. It has a lot of carbs, but you know, the point of this is to make sure you're getting your protein. Look. Omelet bites, 13 grams of protein. For five bucks, that's good. That's not bad. Omelet breakfast bites, pepper uncut, uncured ham, and they got turkey sausage and spinach. That's not bad, that shit looks good, actually. That shit looks good. That shit looks unhealthy. It doesn't look unhealthy. This is like the dessert. dessert stuff. I'm pretty sure they probably have like a protein dessert here too. Like a protein ice cream or something. Like this. Look, keto ice cream. Five grams of net carbs, 389. Something like this at Ross is like seven bucks, nine bucks. Right? What else we got right here? Some more chips, stuff we don't need. 
gonna be like the frozen section. Yes, these are OG. For the price, that's not bad at all. 16 count for four bucks is wild. This is just, un just stuff that does nothing for us, but yeah, so you guys are looking for something like that. Obviously these prices are not bad. All around two bucks to five bucks. find any other protein snacks. Slam. So this would be more your section right here. Protein, shrimp, lamb, stuff like that. Leave all this stuff alone. Avocado chunks. You guys might like that. Protein waffles. Bang. I don't know how much. Three bucks? Protein waffles, three bucks. What is this? Meatballs? Breakfast meatballs? Pretty sure those are lower in carbs. Seven grams of carbs, 11 grams of protein. That's not bad. We'll take that. Not bad. So, see, it's not a bad price. some uh, spices, tortillas. I'm pretty sure they got like some protein tortillas though. Look, zero carb right here, tortillas. Bang. Zero grams of net carbs. You can see the fiber on it. Not bad at all. I'm not fucking with these. I don't know, you're right. But if you guys want some blue corn tortillas, that's actually probably good. But low carb. That's what we're shopping for right now. Look, low carb. Bang. So they got tortillas here. You can shop for it. It's like a regular store. But they, they just have a lot more options when it comes to the higher protein diet. In my opinion. What would you find? Oh, I Miracle Noodles. I heard these are fire, right? We've had them before. So these are they really like good. Nothing. Five calories. Five calories, two grams of carbs, zero protein. These are like if you guys are Italiano. Or some sauce on it. You know what I'm saying? Zero net carbs. Not bad. This is better for you than spin squash spaghetti. Miracle Noodles. Check them out. Spaghetti style, five grams of carbs. No, five calories, one gram of net carb. Boom. Okay, they also got your regular stuff in here, but this is something you're gonna wanna get when you're dieting, obviously, and we're looking for a lower carb diet. Bang. Miracle noodles, not bad. A good selection for seasoning. Obviously, we stay away from the oils. Is this ghee? They have ghee here. This is what you guys need to be cooking with. Ghee or tallow. This is not bad for the price either. This is what you wanna shop for right here, ghee. None of this bullshit. None of this bullshit. Some lemon pepper. Lemon pepper. Is that one or the other one better? What's this one? This is salt free. We need salt. This is more like a. What do you think is better? Crushed pepper, minced garlic. What? This one? Chili powder. Sure, some chili powder. We have this. Oh, no, we don't. Steak seasoning. We don't need all that. Get you some tuna. That's a very good snack when you're eating low carb. Get you some packets to go. Packets to go. Open the can however you want to do it. Bang. 
feel me? Got you some soups and stuff like that. Not bad. That's pretty good. Hmm. Four grams of protein. Chicken dip, two grams of carbs. Let me see. That's not bad. 50 calories. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's actually a good snack, guys. So we found some more protein stuff. What is that? Chicken. Crab? Chicken thighs. Chicken bed rice. Not bad. Veal patty. Veal? Let me see. Grab them. Where do you see that? Breaded veal patty. Oh, that's not bad. Isn't that like that's baby baby goat, right? Or baby what? I don't know. Baby goat, right? Hmm? Some meatballs again, shrimp bites. Obviously, I don't mess with none of that. And I got a couple more snacks over here on this side. Got you some chicken broth down there. Boom. Pricing's not bad. Yeah, I think that's what we found. Showed you guys pretty much the whole store. I've been to other ones and they have, um, it's a little bit bigger. This location is a little smaller, but we're gonna check out. I'm gonna show you guys how much this costs. Go over a quick overview. Are we taking these? I don't know, you put them in the cart. Okay, so we got beef jerky we're gonna try. We got chicharron. We got these protein puffs. Like we got sriracha. We got mint bars up there, and then we got those miracle noodles we're gonna try as well. Without counting, how much do you think it's gonna be? Yeah, five seconds. 20 bucks. 20 bucks? I'm going 29 bucks. 29. 29. 29 with taxes. You're not gonna call me. No. It's gonna be 32.60. Ooh, I was, I was closest though. I said 29. 